stand on our feet as we round up this uh, meeting this morning. And now we want us, each and every one of us, to just bless God for being here this morning. Open your mouth and glorify the name of the Lord that the Lord has given us life and made, us, made it possible for you and I to come together at this moment to give him glory and honor and praise, worship him in the beauty of his holiness. Father, we give you the praise of God because it's not by power, neither by mind, that, Lord, we are able to get up this morning and not only, O oh God, giving us this life and giving us this day that we will rejoice and be glad in it, but, Lord, you brought us, O oh God, before your presence, O oh God, even, O oh God, to share on what, O oh God, Father, will help us, O oh God, even to live this life you have given us here on earth. Father, we say, may your name alone be exalted. And then be praised, O oh God. May your name be exalted. May be magnified, O oh God. Thank you for this day, Lord, you have made. Thank you for this life you have given unto us. Thank you for this opportunity, O oh God, you have granted to each and every one of us to come before your presence. We say receive all the glory, receive all the honor, receive all the praise, receive all adoration. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. People of God, I want us to lift up the AYF before the Lord. Ask the Lord who has caused this very association to come together, this men of God to come together, that the Lord will open our eyes, open our ears, open our heart, and grant us that grace to be able to really fasten out what the Lord intended to do with us, in us, through us, and around us as a result, through this very association, Father Lord. We thank you, Lord, because we know you are the one that impressed this very occasion, O God, in the heart of your children. Father, to come out, O God, with this group gathering every month, O God. And Lord, we are asking, O God, that you will open our eyes. We are asking that you will open our heart. You are asking that you will open our ears, O God, to come to the place where we know, O God, the reason, the purpose for which you have brought us together. That, Lord, we will pursue it, O God, to the glory of your holy name, that only you, O God, will be exalted, that our joy in you, O God, will be full. And not only that, but, Lord, that those that we see and hear what you have done, what you are doing, and what you will do in us, through us and around us, we be edified. We say, may your name alone, O oh God, be exalted this hour. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayer. Let us commit those that are not here today into the hand of God as well, and ask the Father that even by the time we will meet again, each and every one of us will have that uh, very hunger and thirst to be together as we have uh, agreed in the name of Jesus. Father, we bless you, God, because we know, O oh God, Father, that you know everything, even for distance are not far from you, that our brethren that are not here today. Father, you know the reason why each and every one of them is not here. And Lord, we are lifting them to your throne of grace, O God, that you will meet each and every one at that point of need, O God. There are anyone, O God, that have been, O God, have been incarcerated by the powers of the enemy. We stand this hour, Lord, King of glory, and we agree that you will lose them in the name of Jesus Christ. Is there anyone that is going through any issue at this moment that has, O God, being a hindrance to God for them to be with us this morning. Father, we stand, O oh God, Father, and take authority over whatever it is to God. And say, Lord, you will oh God, intervene, O oh God, and bring about the freedom that oh God, our children needed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you and bless you because we believe, O oh God, you will, O oh God, touch their life, O oh God, individually and collectively. Intervene in everything that, O oh God, that is holding each and every one of us, O oh God. And Lord, by the time Oh God, we will come back again. Oh God, that each and every one of us will be together to give you the glory, to give you the honor, to give you the praise that due unto you. Blessed be your name forever. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. And let us pray now and ask the Lord to guide us as we live here. We are not living in the presence of God, that the Lord will be with us and bring us back when we will be gathering again, even next month. Father, in the name of Jesus. We thank you and bless you, God. We are about to go, Father, to depart from this place. And, Lord, we ask that you will guide each and every one of us as we go forth to God. That, 
Lord will continue to go before us and do after us, making every crooked way straight, O oh God. That Lord, you always strengthen us and Lord continue to use us, O oh God, individually and collectively. And everywhere and everything that O oh God we do, that your name, O oh God, will be glorified. And Lord, I will pray, O oh God, that by the time next month, O oh God, at this time we'll be gathering once again. You will bring us, O oh God, together, that together we will honor you. Glory and honor and praise be unto you forever. In Jesus' miraculous name we have prayed. Amen. May we share the grace in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit abide with us now and evermore. And surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Thank you all for coming. And remain blessed.